Hey everyone, it's Lisa from Moon Prism Planner. Welcome back to my channel for another video or welcome to my channel if you're new here. Either way, thanks for clicking and spending a little time with me today. So for today's video, I'm gonna be memory planning the week of March 1st in my Recollection Celestial Planner. This kit that I've already laid down is a kit by Sadie Stickers and I will have the pre-plan with me linked down below or it'll pop up in the cards in case you wanna see how I've already laid down the stickers and got to this point. But basically what I'll do is I will just pre-plan for the week and then I leave um, a lot of blank spaces because I don't have a ton of plans and then I will go back day by day and fill in my planner with the leftovers of the kit and my own stickers with memories and um, things that happen so that's why it's like my memory plan with me it's kind of like memory keeping so let's go ahead and get started with Monday so first up I'm going to go ahead and take a half box from the kit and I'm going to layer that with a little piece of the circle deco that comes in the kit as well as a transparent um, dot from the Giving Girl. It's like a transparent teardrop and um, a Crafts by Towie mail carrier truck um, in gold foil. Everything is gold foil. Um, so that I can mark that I had to run to the post office on Monday. I've been trying to like de-stash a lot of my planner stuff and also FabFitFun stuff that I don't want. Um, and the planner stuff is mostly like Simply Gilded stuff. Um, so yeah, I just have a little Mercari where I go ahead and um, de-stash stuff like that. Um, and then I'm going to take a little flourish from Honey Inked just to put in that um, awkward white space and add a little bit of planner jewelry. Then I'm going to take a page flag from the kit and then a shopping cart from The Given Girl and a, um, what is it called, store script from Wild Summer Designs. I'm going to take the one that says Costco. Um, because we went to, we actually went to Sam's Club on, on Monday, um, cause I needed some gas and some, you know, some like stock up on stuff, but, um, she didn't have Sam's Club on that list. I think Costco is a little more popular, so I just used Costco. Um, and then I'm going to take a pretty like viney kind of flourish thing from Honey Inked as well, just to add a little bit of sparkle. Um, then I'm going to take one of these pretty fancy like bow strong boxes. I think that's what they're called. And then a yoga um, icon from Honey Inked and this one came with a freebie so it's not foiled or anything because I did um, have a nice yoga session on Monday and to accent that bowstring box I'm going to use one of these pretty flourishes from Crafts by Towie and for my gratitude on Monday I just wrote in yoga. Moving on to Tuesday I was going to try to use one of these pretty flourishes from the Pretty Pink Co. Um, in between those that area right there um, for uploading and editing, but it didn't kind of fit nicely, so instead I used another type of flourish from Honey Inked, and then I checked off my checklist for my bill due, not checklist, um, I checked off the bill due since I paid it. Then I'm going to take a half box from the kit, and um, I have this leftover piece of deco from the Giving Girl, um, and I'm also going to take one of her really skinny um, bow dividers. That is from her 2020 advent calendar, and so is this pretty deco. And I didn't really know what to, I didn't want to use something Christmassy because all my Christmas stuff would be like red and green. So, and that's not going to match this kit. So instead I use this really pretty deco. And I think, is that like supposed to be a gift tag or a washi card or something? I'm not quite sure, but it kind of reminded me of gift tags. So that's why I used it. Um, then I also have these really pretty um, like bow little fairy string lights that look so cute in any kind of half box or full box. Um, and then I have a side bow from my freebie with Sticker Guru, so make sure you use my code Lisa15 to get that freebie. Um, anyways, and then the reason I mentioned Christmas is because that box is to denote that I finally took down the remaining Christmas decorations from out of our house. And then I ended up using that Pretty Pink Co. Um, squiggle just down below the half box. So. Um, we purposely leave our Christmas decor up all pretty much like all of January um, because I like to get more than just one month out of it and I don't like to decorate like in November because I like to have fall decor up in November so we just do December and January um, so we we've been slowly taking the down the, the Christmas stuff but we finally managed to finish all of it on March 2nd and I wrote for my gratitude decor decor away because it's just like nice to have it finally all gone and I could like clean up you know um, moving on to Wednesday, I'm going to start off with a flag from the kit and then this pretty like, um, what is this, like a workout icon outfit from the Pretty Pink Co. And then I have a workout script from Sticker Guru. Again, that's on my freebie. Um, or you can just, you know, get 
the workout scripts from Sticker Guru if you want. But, um, you know, use my code for my freebie to get that script. Then, because um, it did a workout. I mean, I do work out usually like six to seven days a week. It's just if I don't have a lot of stuff to mark in my memory planning, I'll kind of mark like mundane things. So I didn't have a ton of stuff to mark on Wednesday. Um, and then I also use this really skinny little bow divider from the Giving Girl Advent Calendar. They're technically bow headers, but they're so skinny and tiny. I think they're maybe meant for like a hobo or like planner, like a hobo weeks or something, maybe a hobo cousin or something. I don't know. Um, so I just use them as dividers because they're really cute and skinny. Um, then on the bottom, I'm going to take a half box and then another piece of that really pretty deco from the Giving Girl. It's kind of like a Chanel bag, basically. Um, which I don't know, like Chanel and Chili's don't really go together because <laughs> it's not like Chili's is high class or anything, but we, um, picked up Chili's for dinner on Wednesday because we had a gift card and, um, I don't know. I just felt like the bag kind of denoted like going out and getting dinner for some reason. Anyways, I just have this pretty deco from the Given Girl. I just want to use, you know, um, then I'm going to take this fun size box, like a little bow strong box from the Given Girl that was a freebie. It's this really cute kind of like social media themed freebie. Um, and I picked up my free birthday cookies, um, because my birthday was a couple of weeks ago and I got a free coupon for, um, you know, birthday cookies. So I'm just going to layer that box with a hexagon from the kit. And then this cute little, I, it kind of looks like it could be a cookie in a bag to me. Um, from Paper Shire and then another pretty leaf from Honey Inked. And then I went back up to workout and just added an embellishment under workout from Honey Inked as well. And I wrote for Wednesday, I was grateful for closing my rings three times in a row. Um, since that's not always easy. <laughs> then moving on to Thursday, I'm going to take an arrow from the kit and then this, um, floral springy happy meal icon from Strawberry Creek Studio $1 Wednesday. Just to write that I had to do another Mercari drop off at the post office on Thursday. Then I'm going to grab a quarter box from the kit and I have a really old $1 Wednesday from Strawberry Creek, which um, is this kind of like Frappuccino, kind of like milkshake drink. Um, so I use that to mark going to get Starbucks on Thursday. I don't know if everybody got the um, email or what. Oh, by the way, I'm also going to take a uh, transparent dot from the Giving Girl and then another side book from Sticker Guru and then the Starbucks script from Sticker Guru from a $2 Tuesday, um, which I believe they're actually having a throwback to $2 Tuesday today, um, the, the day this video goes live on the, um, the 9th. Yeah, tomorrow's the 9th, right? Um, well, or today, the day you're seeing this. Anyways, so go check them out. Um, I put my name in the notes, but what I was saying was, I don't know if everybody got this email, but, um, my husband and I got this email from Starbucks that said, if you go and get a grande size drink or larger on Thursday, then you get a coupon for a free drink the following week. So we were pretty excited to go and get that since we would be getting a free drink in return. So, um, then I dropped my son off at my, at, uh, at his father's house, um, since he was going to have him for the week, well, the weekend ish kind of for a couple of days. Um, so I used a little flag from the, from the kit and then a dad's house script from Strawberry Creek and a, another pen flourish type of divider, um, from Honey Inked, which I wish I had noticed. I didn't notice at first that I had already had one of those right next to Friday. So I'm going to end up changing that Friday went out, but you'll see that later. Um, I, for my gratitude on Thursday, I wrote free workouts because again, I do have been doing workouts daily and I'm just grateful that there are free, tons and tons of free workouts online. So, um, moving on to Friday there, you can see that the two flourishes are exactly the same next to each other. I don't know why I didn't see that. Um, so moving on to Friday, I'm going to take a third box from the kit along with a, um, TV doodle from Wildsmore Designs and then a side bow transparent dot from the Giving Girl to mark the One Division finale which was sad to see it go because I thought it was such a good show. I wish there was more episodes and more seasons, but it was a great show. Um, and then I'm going to take these cute little um, trend, or clear sticker heart clusters from the Giving Girl inside the TV. Then I'm going to take a little arrow from the kit and a $1 Wednesday, or no, that's not $1 Wednesday, sorry. It's just a like box package stack from Strawberry Creek and then this doodly arrow transparent dot just to mark that. Um, Georgie from Strawberry Creek sent me a DHL delivery because I help her out with her, um, orders occasionally. And then for my gratitude Friday, I wrote the Scarlet Witch. I've been going around actually saying that I'm the Scarlet Witch because it's just so freaking cool. <laughs> um, then on Saturday I checked off my checklist and I wrote in the movie we watched for our movie night, which was Monster Hunter. It's based on a video game. Um, then I'm going to take an appointment label from the kit and then I have this, um, older, like little house icon from the Giving Girl with a little bow, little bow corner thing. 
a little side note, that's the word, <laughs> um, to mark that my son came home on Saturday um, from his dad's house. So he was only there for a couple of days. Um, and then I'm going to take a, what is this? A little mini, like, scallop corner? Oh, sorry for the yawn. Like a scalloped corner from the kit. She's got a ton of, um, Alicia's got a ton of layering stuff in the kit, so I super appreciate that. So I'm going to take the scalloped corner and then a um, nail polish bow doodle icon from Dasha Sun Designs, which I start appearing for her again too. Make sure you use my code Lisa10, um, or you can just put my name in the notes. Same with Sticker Guru, you can just put my name in the notes um, to get my freebie too. And I just marked that um, my new po um, polish shipped from Holo Taco. Um, the new unicorn collection, the like nails in the clouds collection is so pretty. And then I'm going to take one of the um, leaf, you know, flourish decos uh, from Honey Inked again. This one was from like um, the Gathered Plans freebie, I think. And yeah, so I got the new collection from Hollow Taco for my um, birthday. It was a belated present from my son, so I thought that was sweet. Now, I didn't realize when I was taking this flourish up, I should have taken off the one on Thursday and replaced it. But for some reason, I thought that Friday was the one that was fresher. Um, so it was really hard to pull up because that sticker actually had been there for like an entire week. Um, so you can, as you can see, you can still pull up stickers with undo when they're old, but it's really, really hard. If I had used the undo on the one on Thursday, it would have came up way easier because it was fresh. Um, but I forgot that the Thursday was the one that I put down fresh and not Friday. Anyways, though, I ended up getting that flourish up because I noticed how they looked weird next to each other. And I used another little skinny um, bow divider from The Giving Girl. And then I have this older sheet from The Giving Girl with a bunch of icons and scripts and things. Um, she used to include this sheet, this whole big sheet in her kits. And so I have a few of them left over and I just used some of the stars to kind of add a little sparkle throughout the spread. Um, and then I used one of her transparent doodly heart icons um, on Monday because I thought that that box had a little extra white space that was kind of hard to fill up because of, um, I just wrote PO run to the left. Anyways, so I just put that there to kind of fill up a little bit more of that half box that I used. Um, then moving on to, I think I forgot to write my gratitude in, but we'll get, I'll get to there eventually. <laughs> moving on to Sunday, I'm going to take a third box from the kit and I'm going to use one of these, um, sandwich icons from, was it the planner pixie cow? I forgot to look, hang on. Nope, sorry, that was from Inspire Ever After. And um, that's because we usually do like a sandwich Sunday or a sandwich Saturday. And um, normally I don't mark that in my planner, but this time we decided to get Capriati's. They have the impossible um, meat over there because my husband and I don't eat meat. So we usually get an impossible cheesesteak, it's so good. Or they also have like vegetarian turkey options. So, or like a vegetarian cheesesteak, a chicken cheesesteak, it's so good, so many options. Anyways, so I just marked what we got for dinner and then I used another flourish from Honey Inked. Then I updated my checklist and I used one of the clean scripts um, from The Giving Girl from The Leftovers um, since I did a little tidying up on Sunday. I'm gonna take another third box from the kit and then this arrow that comes in the kit along with a uh, transparent teardrop that is like already right there <laughs> from The Giving Girl. It was cause I was gonna use it and then I eventually didn't. So whenever I do that with stickers, I'll usually just like stick it down on the sticker kit. Um, and then I have a really old One Dollar Wednesday from Strawberry Creek, which is, I just thought really cute because it's like a box with a bunch of little happy hearts coming out of it. And, um, that's just to mark that I had ordered some Weight Watchers snacks, um, because you earn like points for doing like healthy habits and then you can redeem your points for free things. And so I redeemed my points for store credit from their shop, which I've never bought anything from their shop before. So I thought, why not get some other snacks, see if they're good. Um, so I was really excited to have my snacks arrive on Sunday, especially cause Sunday's like mail doesn't come, but they delivered it like FedEx or something. So it was really cool. Um, then I'm going to take another one of those bow strung fairy lights from the giving girl. And then another one of the like, um, squiggly flourishes, uh, from the pretty pink co. But I wanted to have the box layered on top of the flourish instead of the other way around. So I had to kind of dig it out of there, but it was fine. Um, and then in between those two, uh, third boxes, there's not a lot of room, so I'm just going to take one of these skinny dividers from the Given Girls 2020 Advent Calendar to put in there and be done with that. And then, like I said, I forgot my gratitude, so for Saturday's gratitude, I wrote Easy Work Day because it was really slow. I ended up getting no phone calls, no chats, no nothing. Um, and then Sunday, I wrote Reset because I had a nice yoga session that was all about like resetting, so it was really great.
that's going to be it for this memory plan with me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up because I truly appreciate your support and it does help out my channel and my video. Be sure you subscribe so you don't miss more of my videos because I do put out content regularly and leave me a comment down below if you have a question or just want to say hi because I will say hi back. I hope that y'all take care. Remember that you are loved, you are worthy, and you are enough just the way that you are. Don't let anyone ever tell you otherwise. Stay safe, have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see y'all in my next video. All right, take care, y'all. Bye. Thank you.